Okay, We've got Coach Michael here today to show us some wrestling technique. Michael, what do you have for us today? Okay, so we're going to do a bit of a modified wrestling to MMA submission technique. Really easy transition movement. We're going to go from a duck under, break down to a modified gut wrench, an upper gut wrench, where you can go to the upper part of the body. Okay, and from there, you can go into a submission like an, like an arm bar or a rear naked choke. So, we're going to break this down. First, a duck under is simply what it sounds like. I'm going to duck under my opponent. Inside control, gripping the head like so. I'm going to pop up this arm, come here. My ear is against his body, it's high. I come around, bring my right hand to his hip. I'm cranking the neck while I'm doing this. And then I'm breaking him down, because this is actually quite easy for me to do. And he comes down, like so. Now from here, Ramsey's still in a bit of a solid position. Now for a jiu-jitsu guy, they may know what to do, but I'm a wrestler, so I have to do a breakdown from here. So there's many ways you can do this. Uh, you can either grab from the wrist, you can grab, you can kick into the rear here. I like to go from a gut wrench position a lot, so I'll slam my arm in, grip, break him down here. Now my opponent will probably go to his stomach from here, if it's a wrestling match. Now if they're here, and lying on their stomach, I will then go into now a modified gut wrench, which is an upper gut wrench. So here, I move in, gable grip here, lock in, and from here I'm doing a lot of the same gut wrench technique, but this time I'm just doing it from an upper position here. From here I'm gonna get tight, squeeze in, my right foot is against his hip, my left knee is against his other hip, pop through, nice and tight like a bowl constrictor. Okay, nice and tight. Ramsey's are comfortable? Nope. From here, you can go into submissions. They're available. Your naked choke is the really one of the few I know. You can do arm bars too. Ramsey's a bit better than that. So, let's break that down a bit more. Let's go from step by step, okay? So again, we're here. I duck under. Ear is against the body. That's the key. Nice and tight. Grab the hips. Crank down the body. Now, we either crank until he goes all the way down, or you break him down. From here, move into the gut wrench position. Nice and tight, pop over. Submissions are available, okay? That's how you do it. So guys, some additional um, notes here. With the upper gut wrench, if you were seeing from my perspective, I'm usually doing the gable grip here, okay? I'll be coming up here, out about here, close to his sternum. Okay, right around there. Then from there, I grip in like so. Okay, so to watch my arms, I'm not doing this, but I'm doing this. So it actually takes a lot of pressure and power, and you gotta get good at it. Now, depending on the girth of your opponent, sometimes you can do these grips, but this is the best grip, okay? From here, nice and tight, in. Hey, Ramsey? Yep. Yeah, so that's what you want there. Then you can break down onto the shoulders. Yeah. yeah. So from, from what I'm feeling there, you're both pulling the arms in, but also driving the chest and the shoulders exactly. forward, correct? Um, for maybe our jiu-jitsu friends, think about how you, how you compress in a triangle. And it's very similar. That's what you're looking for. You're looking for that compression there, except for this, you're using your upper body. Yeah, yeah I, I can't stress enough. Well, from a camera perspective, it might just look like the hand goes here, the hand goes there. Every one of these grips has a ton of pressure behind them. Mm -hmm. 